everyone welcome to my channel develop my dad seo in today's video i am going to answer one of our viewers question how to fix the viewport not set to device with issues and some other mobile usability issues so if you are working on your website to fix the mobile usability issues on your website then this video is going to help you so before getting into the video if you are new to my channel i am ish search engine marketer and do you want more videos about page speed optimization and how to make your website more user friendly and search engine friendly and to drive organic traffic for your website then subscribe to this channel don't forget to ask your questions give your feedback and make the channel more engaging let's get into the video You can get your mobile usability report on Google Search Console. So the mobile usability report shows the pages which has usability issues when viewed on mobile devices. So if your user is using mobile devices to access your website and they may find difficulties in website or navigating through the elements sometimes the clickable elements may too close together so if the user click on one elements the link will open for another element sometimes the user need to scroll the device horizontally to look read the content and sometimes the images may be very larger and sometimes the text may be very the fonts text font size may be very too small to read it so these are mobile usability issues so if you are if your website has mobile usability issues the foremost thing is you have to make your website mobile friendly on impressions you can see how much impressions your website has get on the mobile on the mobile search results the higher the impressions the higher the chances for users to click on your website so the foremost thing to fix the mobile usability issues is to make your website mobile friendly so good mobile experience is going to be an important ranking signal so google is predominantly using mobile content for ranking and indexing so this means the mobile first indexing so if your user is using uh you are using mobile devices to access your website then you should provide the best user experience on the mobile device not only the mobile device whatever the device the user is using your website should be responsive and it should provide a best user experience so what does responsive website mean so basically responsive website works behind the principle of css media queries so where the css media queries help to check the height and width of the device type and also the height and width of the viewport so it set the viewport according to the device type so this is the basic concept behind the responsive website design so if your website want to be mobile friendly it should be a responsive website so these are the errors uh, you get under the mobile usability report so if your website is mobile friendly and responsive website the chances are less you get these issues so the solution is you have to make your website theme responsive you have to update to the latest version of wordpress and you have to keep updated on all the plugins that are used on your website so my recommendation is be cautious and take a backup of your website before going to change anything on your uh, cms so um, take a backup of your website and update your cms to the latest version by updating to the latest version you can um, make sure your website is uh has all the security uh security thing that the website need and the responsive website and the responsiveness and make sure to test the theme is mobile friendly or not
you can test the uh, theme template, the empty theme. So you can test whether it is mobile friendly or not using the mobile friendly test. And at the same time, I recommend you to test the theme, empty theme, that is the template on paid speed insight tool. This shows how uh, light or weight your website theme is. So according to that, you can decide whether to whether to use the theme or not. So I hope you have learned something new from this video. And if you find it useful, please subscribe to this channel and follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter. See you on another useful video. Until then, this is Ish.